so here is my pistol build. I run three different variations. This is my main one. I will kind of go through each of them. But this is my main one. I run the M45A1. I would love to have max pistol damage, but for right now I only have 11% with 10% to damage uh, to targets out of cover with Optimist. My Coyote's Mask, I got uh, max weapon damage, 5.8 crit hit chance, 11.8 crit hit damage, 11.4 crit hit damage. And of course you already know how this works. 0 to 15 plus 25 critical hit damage, 15 to 25 plus 10% critical hit damage request. and chance. And then 25 meters plus, you get plus 25 critical hit chance. My chest piece, I am running perfect glass cannon. 13.4 weapon damage, 9% headshot damage, 5.5 crit hit chance, 11.8 crit hit damage. The only thing about this chest piece is that yes you do a lot of damage but you also take in even more damage so you have to be pretty cautious whenever you're running this. You cannot just run up in a group and start going all kind of rambo on them because most likely you're going to get fucking killed. So you got to play a little bit smarter when you have perfect glass cannon on there. On to the holster I have Douglas and Harding. 13.7 weapon damage, 11.9 crit hit chance, or crit damage, and max headshot damage. Knee pads, running grupo, 12.2 weapon damage, 5.9 crit hit chance, and max crit hit damage. Gloves, everything is god rolled, max weapon damage, max crit hit damage, and max crit hit chance. As for the backpack, Max weapon, repair, and crit hit chance with 11.5 crit hit damage. I'm running vi uh, Vigilance on here, so I get plus 25% weapon damage, and whenever I take damage, that buff or that talent goes away, so. Skills, I'm running the shield. Like I said, there's uh, three variants that I run, but this is the main one. The shield is only for, like, tight spot situations. You don't want to rely too much on it, only maybe to deflect a couple of rounds here and there and then just kind of get your guy down fast as possible. But that's a shield, nothing special about it. Running the jammer because there's plenty of people out there that do not know how to play without a stinger. They are stinger dependent. So they'll usually run a stinger, they'll run a turret, seekers, attack drone, that's pretty much about it. They use a tr uh, the decoy and sticky bomb sometimes, but other than that, <coughs> that's pretty much for this build. So the stats on this build, I got 59.2 crit hit chance. I got 162.4 crit hit damage, but when you count in for the coyote's mask, it gives you that plus 25. So really you're up playing up close when you're fighting players so with that plus 25 you'll end up with 187 percent crit hit damage and then you have oh, excuse me 88.8 .8 headshot damage and I was looking at the wrong one so let me go ahead and do it there we go 59.2 crit hit chance 162.4 crit hit damage and 138 headshot damage and like I was saying with the crit hit damage you got 162.4 plus the 25 that brings us to 187 you look at your weapon damage <clears throat> you got your 94.3 for all weapon damage bonuses plus your pistol damage bonus at 46 which will bring you to 140 percent weapon damage so we'll go out over here test this bad boy Make sure I got it on. Alright, so headshots is the 2.2 million to the head. So you'll see it. We're at 2.1. to the body you'll hit an average let's see 
about anywhere from 1.4 to 1.5. All right, so here's the next variation. The only things that I changed on here was the mask, the talent on the chest piece, and the holster. So for the mask, this is what I usually run if uh, you know I kind of want to get in uh, tighter spaces and I can take a little bit more damage, not too much. So the mask, I got Gilligard, almost max uh, armor, 100% scanner pulse haste, 11.8 crit hit damage, and 11.4 crit hit damage. Chess piece, the only thing that switched out was your talent. So I got unbreakable instead of glass cannon. So I got 14% weapon damage, 12% weapon handling. I wish I would have headshot damage, but I don't. And 11% crit hit damage, 11.8 crit hit damage. As for the holster, another Douglas and Harding with max armor, crit hit damage, and I wish I had headshot damage instead of explosive resistance, but that's what I got. So as for this one, forty seven point nine crit hit chance. 173.5 crit hit damage, 119 headshot damage. Go with this one. So this one's not going to hit as hard, but it will take people down pretty fast. 